I am with Michelle. Say hello, Michelle. I'm doing a video. Hello, say hello. <laughs> you gone shy. And here we are in Manchester's nearest park, which shows that you can still build green spaces in urban areas. And it's absolutely fantastic. And for those who don't know Manchester, probably heard a little clue, is there's the line into Piccadilly train station just up there and uh, just heard a little a horn of a, a train it's absolutely amazing they've done an incredible job here every credit to uh, the team who made this possible the council in Manchester and all the people behind it absolutely fantastic and already wildlife's here it looks really good really good so we shall go and explore This is their play area, which is pretty impressive. It's very clean and tidy, isn't it? Goes around there, That's where we just come from. And over there is some water. You just see it in there. Absolutely stunning. Are you going on the slide, Michelle? Absolutely brilliant. It's a lot better than I thought it would be. It's incredible. Love the rapids and the rocks, but just love that this isn't like being pushed through by a mechanical pump. It's just nature. Yeah. Yeah. All right. That's right. It's been well adopted by nature already, isn't it? It's a big slide. What do you think of the statue, Michelle? Do you like it? Yeah, it's nice enough. It's very tactile and colourful. It's a great bridge, you know. That water over there is brilliant. Oh, train. So it must sort of take you across from there, along there then. Gardens are okay as well. Some nice grasses, so they're easy to maintain. Yeah, that's right, yeah, because you've got this circular path, haven't you? Yeah, it down, yeah. Really. that sort of connects. Yeah, that's right. There's water in the middle. Yeah, it works really well. So they've really made maximum use of the space to make it look far bigger. And you're quite well cut off from the traffic as well. Brilliant, and adults can use them as well. And they are, yeah, <laughs> part of this amazing place. Do you 
Michelle? No one could hear you. <laughs> For the viewers, Michelle say yes, she likes it very much. She's got camera shy. Hmm. And this head takes us back to where we came from, the entrance there. So we've sort of been all the way around over there and then coming back on the south. I just love the use of the, the river or that they've connected it into a river and really opened it all out. Brilliant. We're just saying how little graffiti there is in here. And it is every credit to them. Are you okay? Just trying to get up. <laughs> Do you want me to help you? Here we go. I'll go and help her. But it looks great. Every credit to him. There's a chap over there cutting the grass. Yeah, he's doing a grand job, he is. As well. So that is Mayfield Park. Would highly recommend it for a visit. What about you, Michelle? Would you recommend it? Yeah. Yeah. What was your favourite bit? Nice sunny day. Nice sunny day, yeah, yeah. It's impressive, isn't it? Mm. What was your favourite bit? The river. The river, same, yeah. The way they connected the river into it is uh, absolutely fantastic. So yeah, if you get a chance, if you're anywhere near Piccadilly Station, and we've got half an hour, it's literally just Piccadilly Station's just over there. So come out where the tram uh, tram stop is. Um, Onto the main road, follow it across to Mayfield Station, which is there. You can see it from platforms 13 and 14. It's just next to it. Well worth a visit. And uh, yeah, if you get a chance, definitely, definitely come. And every credit to Manchester for building a brand new urban park and being an inspiration to everybody else that you can still build green spaces in urban, urban areas.